Ever since Russia started its invasion of Ukraine, Beijing and Taipei have been watching the situation unfold carefully. Will Taiwan be the next victim of increasing global turbulence? Let's find out in this week's video. Taiwan, or as it's sometimes called Formosa, was originally inhabited by Austronesian people from South China region 10,000 years ago. It changed multiple hands from Dutch in 1622 to the Qing dynasty in 1683 to Japan in 1895. Finally, after World War II, Taiwan was unified with mainland China, who at that time had a republic government. Following a civil war that broke out between nationalists under Chiang Kai-shek and communists under Mao Zedong, the defeated nationalists fled to Taiwan in 1949. Taiwan went through a period called White Terror under Chiang, suffering imprisonments and executions on a day-to-day -day basis. But all this changed in 1957. After intense political movement in Taipei and the death of Chiang, the nationalists finally lost their iron grip on Taiwan and a new era of democracy was finally born. China considers Taiwan part of its territory to be taken control of by force if necessary. But Taiwan's leaders say that Taiwan is a sovereign state. After decades of hostile intentions and angry rhetoric, relations between China and Taiwan started improving in the 1980s. China put forward a formula known as One Country, Two Systems, under which Taiwan would be given significant autonomy if it accepted Chinese reunification. But Taiwan outright rejected it. Only 14 countries, including Vatican, recognized Taiwan as an independent country, fearing the wrath of China. Taiwan has also been kept out of international bodies like WHO. This systematic diplomatic isolation coupled with Taiwan's huge export dependence of Beijing, has made the situation only worse. China has been quite open that it will annex Taiwan militarily if needed before the 100-year anniversary of Chinese Communist Party coming in 2049. In October 2020, President Xi Jinping asked the PLA to prepare for war triggering alarm in Taiwan, which read it as an open threat. PLA jets and Navy vessels intrude into Taiwanese ter territory so often that it has become a daily sighting now. And now with the Ukrainian invasion going on, strongmen around the world are viewing it carefully as it would serve as a template for their future endeavors. Even though mechanisms like AUKUS and Quad are put in place to counter exactly this, its effectiveness, especially the willingness of USA to get involved in it is questionable. Whatever may be the case, this issue will one day serve as a linchpin to determine the superpower for the next century. If you find this video informative, like the video, comment below and share this with your friends. Follow us for more history and geopolitical related topics. Click the bell icon and subscribe to Cape Now.